ahead of me and always <laughs> I'm three years ahead of my little sister, right? So my cousin, my cousin, okay, so she had come to live with us when we was, I was leaving middle grade and going to high school. And she was in high school and like, she, you know, she was like, First of all, she was the cat's ass because she had, like, fucking green eyes. And when I tell you she had green eyes, she had, like, fucking emerald green eyes. Fucking black girl with emerald. Like, she was light-skinned, like, you know, but... Also, I don't understand people these days don't be understanding black girls when they see a black girl. Like, yeah, this bitch was light, but light bright, but not quite white. (laughs) Like, exactly. Bitch, like, but now, but now, if we in the grocery store, they all confused, ma'am and ma'am, and then they look at me like, uh, yes, how can I help you, bitch? You just ma'am and ma'am, and now I'm how can I help you? Anyways, I don't know why that is. Yeah, because you're the same color as Brooke. <laughs> so maybe that's why you don't know what that is, but that's what it is. And so, but anyways, so back at the time. She would, like, obviously teach me shit, right? Because she's my big cousin, you know what I mean? We would be in the game together. She's older than you? She's three years older than me. Mm-hmm. And she, she, but she was, like, my motherfucking bitch. Like, before Golden Girls, we was, like, <laughs> before Golden Girls, we was, like, you know. And if I threw a party, <laughs> and if I did everyone. We was like that. We was, we was like golden girls and shit. So she used to tell me shit. So she'd be like, okay, I'm about to call this number. Don't say shit. If you say shit, I'm going to fucking beat the fuck out of you. And she would. She, she was a big old fucking thick black bitch. She's like, yo ass. She would beat the fuck out of me. I'm all little and shit. A <laughs> little reeking blood. I'd be like, all like, man. <laughs> You're right. <laughs> Your ass. But she's fucking a big old, like, fucking five foot seven. You know what I mean? Uh, that Maybe that's not big to some people, but that's big to me. <laughs> yeah. No, that's. <laughs> that's big to me. I'm only fucking five three and three quarters. Five four on paper, if anybody asks them. You <laughs> stupid. <laughs> <laughs> Trying to so, get you little inches, whatever. Inches, bitch. Five four. I'm not claiming that five three and three. <laughs> Bullshit. Okay. That's really am. Okay. So anyway, so she's like tall for me. So she be telling me things though. Anyway, she be telling me things. And she be like, all right, this this is how we're gonna run game on this. Even like she used to tell me, all right, me and my cousin used to hustle together. And we would pull up to the gas station. We would have gas in the car. Mm-hmm. But she would just be like, hey, we about to get a pack of cigarettes and some gas. <laughs> some gas? Nigga. Oh, my God. I feel so hood right now. She would be like, we about to get a pack of cigarettes and some gas right now. And maybe some milk for later. She would always say some milk for later. So then we would, like, pull up to the gas station. And she like... Oh, a sir, and like you know, she has good hair. Like, <laughs> I don't got good hair, so I can do. I got a little afro, but she like she has. She would have like this one was little. There was no, there was no fake hair. There was no tracks. There was no weaves. This is in oh, she was in nineteen ninety four. This is in nineteen ninety four, bitch. You had what you had, okay? right? No, yeah, so, <laughs> I know. You better work with it, bitch. You have what you had. Anyways, we be laughing about this shit all the time about, like, you really couldn't be ugly back then because... (laughs) 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 Because everybody would know you was ugly. Uh, Now you can be ugly as fuck. Right. You can just be ugly as fuck. Then you just have fake hair and whatever. And it's like, I got fake hair, but bitch, I gotta look at myself when I gotta take off this fake hair. Okay. I know what I look like. Right. (laughs) <laughs> anyway okay i digress i digress so she we would pull up to the gas station or whatever she'd be like all right we're about to get some gas and pack of cigarettes and like she would like name someone random like in a, in a fucking <laughs> <laughs> strawberry and fucking cheesecake ice cream bar i love right? it i she love like, it or some oh she was the hella hood so some fucking um mystic or some fucking uh, why? Alize. Yes. Mystic is 
They used to have um, I remember the St. Bartlett's. And then, <laughs> then it went to Arbor Miss, basically. Yeah, but the, oh my God, they were so hood. Okay, so, and she would love wine coolers. Love, love wine coolers. Anyways. Damn, why wasn't I doing this? So, we would pull up to the gas station or whatever, and she would, oh, sir, I don't have any gas. Dental on the stress, you know, green eyes, freckles, like long hair, whatever. And they'd be like, oh, baby, we need to get you some gas. They would fill up our whole gas tank. We would have it, like, they wouldn't know that it had a little bit of gas in it, but like it would be like a quarter tank of gas or whatever. They would fill up the whole other three quarters, take us in the gas station. And do you guys rem- like remember like at the um at the gas stations back in the day in California, it used to be like a whole ass like little restaurant. Like it used to have like hot dogs and popcorn. No, no gas station I went to had that. Okay, well, was that we in the hood? It's called Good Choice. Yes. Okay. It's called Good Choice. It was on Mount. They fifth. have these in the hood. Mountain and Fifth in Ontario. <laughs> Not in the suburbs. Holla, hallelujah, holla back. Oh, so, Lord. Uh, Mountain and Fifth, and then it was called Good Choice, and they used to have, like, little, like, popcorn and, um, like, hot dogs <laughs> and, like, like bullshit, okay. like, fake food. So, right? which, what would she come back with? So, then we would go into the place. They would fill up the gas tank. She smoked Newport short box. So we get a pack of Newport short box. We get Shorts. some fucking mist, <laughs> short box. mystic, mystic <laughs> fucking wine coors. Yes. The fucking red ones that taste like throw up. That just remind me of throw up at this point in my life. Like they just actually taste like throw up to me. Like I don't even know what they Cause taste like. Because you threw up hella wine coolers Man. then. You just, they just taste like throw up. And um and like one of those like gas station like hot dogs <laughs> and, some, and the beat ass the cashews they would keep in the hot lights. You know yes, what I'm bitch. Woo! I'm trying to tell you those cashews that they keep in the hot lights. Those motherfuckers were save amazing. your life. Bitch, they got those at Green Valley. Man, we get some of those. We get in the car. We go down. Go either go up to the mountains, Mount Ball. <laughs> go down to the beach. We would be drinking on some Mad Dog 2020 or some Mystic. Oh my god! And smoking blunts and fucking eating hot cashews. Off Mad the Dog and having Newports and all kinds of ghetto ass shit. And that was like the life. But that why? Life. Okay, she introduced you to the telephone line. But she would do okay. So that was her like scam of the gas stations, right? Right. Okay, so then she would be like on the phones. She'd be like, hey, we about to call these people. Don't say shit unless I tell you to say something. So then we hop on the party lines and like, okay, so you know on the party lines we used to call the party lines. First, you'd be in the group pool, right? You'd be in the group pool. I think so. And you could hear everybody's messages. No, and like, damn. Message. This is how it used to work. You can hear everybody's messages. Then, if you, uh, a specific person or person, oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. they would be like, you dial, press the button. Dial six nine three five to talk to John. <laughs> yes. And, and like, and then and like John would be like, "Hi, I'm John from San Francisco. <laughs> I'm an investment banker. I'm into hot bitches." And then, yes. like, and then, and then my cousin would be like, "Hi, John from." <laughs> Hi John. <laughs> Where's that just go? I'm I'm and she would be like she would be like So I'm here with my best friend. Say hi best friend and then she'd like say hi bitch and she'd like punch me like right because she's my big cousin and she, she there was like there was like no fucking reciprocity. It was just do what this bitch says like, right. that. So I'd be like, Hi John and then <laughs> like trying to tell like my cousin, right? And she would, like, oh yeah, so like, um, like she would have all the games. She would have mad game. She'd be like, so we're just like standing here smoking cigarettes, and like we would, because this is when she would first start smoking cigarettes. So like we thought we were all cool smoking cigarettes because she smoked Newport. So yeah, <laughs> yeah. And so we thought we were all cool. And my mom would never be at home because this bitch was always working. So we would be in my room. My room was the OG room. And also it connected like a little bit to the garage so that you could jump out my window to the garage. Nice. And so 
we'd be in my room smoking cigarettes and talking to dudes on the party line. And she'd be like, so, John, um, like, well, if you, like, want to see me, um, you can meet me at the Ontario airport. But, like, I don't trust you. So, like, first, why don't you, like, send me and my bitch a little gift in the mail. And you can send it, too. And she would have, like, the P.O. box all set up. Damn. And then, like, she would, like, send it, right? And, like, so, like, for the longest time... We would be getting shit. Like, our favorite place was from San Francisco because there's a lot of perverts in San Francisco. Yeah, there is. And, like, sorry, San Francisco. <laughs> um, like, there's, there is, though. Y'all niggas be freaks. Freaks. And, <laughs> and so, then, like, we would be getting all kinds of shit, bitch. All kinds of shit. All kinds of shit. Like, my cousin was a G. Like, she'd oh be like, God. oh, then, this is, like, before motherfuckers even knew about gift cards, bitch. Before motherfuckers knew about gift cards, we would be eating out all the time. We'd be doing all all kind of crazy shit. She be getting purses sent to us in the motherfucking dust bag, all perfect, all perfect from fucking San Francisco. Designer purses, like shit we didn't even know about. Mm-hmm. Shit we didn't even know about. And then <coughs> one day I fucked up. Oh no. I tried to take a call by myself. <laughs> <laughs> And I got a boy, I got him to send some shit, right? Right to your address. Right to the address, send some money and a little clutch, right? Oh, no. So, I thought I was all fancy and shit. My mom would never be home, right? She'd never be home. For some reason, this bitch was home. <laughs> oh, my God. And she fucking intercepted the motherfucking mailman. The bitch came up on $300 and a fucking little Louis purse back in the day. This isn't like this bitch. This isn't like 1998, 2000. This is all bad. This is all moms was mad as fuck. Like, bitch, where you getting my money? I fucking thought I was about to die. Like, she was gonna kill me. Like, for real. Oh my god. What is this letter? This is when you used to write letters to niggas. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Spray that shit with perfume. Spray it with perfume. We would get another dude to buy us like some Givenchy fucking perfume. Some fucking. Oh, you know what it was back in the day? It was the um, Tresor. Tresor, that fucking shit that came in the fucking pyramid bottle it was like a brown cologne come oh, on no. bitch i know you know what it is it was no like, my parents didn't wear perfumes oh, and cologne this, this is some fancy shit we seen in the magazine that we saw some motherfucker to buy us we didn't know armani <laughs> go nah, cheap nah, it was called like transor it was some french shit anyways we had sprayed this letter and this shit. <laughs> told this nigga all kinds of stupid ass shit. <laughs> Brick sent out the letter. We was like, we was like Gucci, right? He sent the shit back. He sent back. I had told him three hundred dollars. I had specified. I did, bitch. You know, and three hundred dollars. Three hundred dollars was like yeah, babe, a like, thousand. It was like three thousand. I didn't know right. you no know, three hundred dollars. Me neither. Like that one time when I was not even on my age. birthday. Bitch, not even on my birthday. There was no such thing. You know, goddamn sweet sixteen. There was none of this shit. None of it. None of it. Bitch, three hundred dollars was like my whole motherfucking life and shit. I right, I was like, I live forever. Fucking <laughs> shit. Anyway, so this motherfucker sent this shit to this house. He sent it to my house. My mom, my mom got it before we got it. <clears throat> she fucking, we came home. She was like, who is Phil? <laughs> what is this money? What are you girls doing? <laughs> oh, my we God. We like America's Most Wanted and shit. Uh, dun, dun, dun. Two <laughs> girls. <laughs> if you've seen these motherfuckers, two girls. Uh, they are ripping off double lives at on the party line. Perfectly normal teenage <laughs> girls, and as us. Oh my god! Call girls oh via god. party line. Like my mom had underage a- girls on the party say. line. So then she tried to say, "Return this." First, she tried this bitch. She's so full of shit, though. Did she go, you need she to know. return this. You need to return this.